up everybody welcome back to hype hunters and as you can see we got a little bit different here we are now doing face cam in the videos i have in front of me some ufc prism i am i've been so excited for this product i've been looking forward to it uh it's probably my most anticipated product probably since prism basketball came out i've been hyped for this ever since it was announced as a retail version uh, coming out like April 28th or something. So I have been super excited for this one. Really looking forward to getting into it. Uh, this week, Walmart has been getting stocked like crazy. Was able to pick up a bunch of new products that we'll be ripping for you guys on the channel here. But uh, this is by far my most excited for uh, opening. So we got UFC Prism, two blasters that we're gonna go through today. Was debating if I wanted to keep one sealed, but way too excited to, to not uh, to not open them. So let's get started and go ahead and hop right into these. I'm not very knowledgeable in UFC, but uh, I love watching fights and I love uh, kind of following the sport as much as possible. I know the big names, Conor McGregor, Khabib, Jorge, um, all those ones, but uh, some of these new, like the rookie cards, I probably won't be too familiar with, but really anything that's a rookie is going to be pretty cool. So uh, as you can see on the box here, it comes with uh, four cards per pack and there's six packs per box. So these were retailing for right around $20 each. And I think the resale value has came down a whole bunch if you are looking to get some. When they first started, it was up near like, I don't even know, close to a hundred bucks, close to over a hundred for resale. But uh, now I think you can get some close to around 50 bucks. So it's came down a substantial amount. And let's see if we can hop into this pack one. So I've really not watched many videos on UFC Prism, but uh, this is exciting. All right, first card of the pack is a Vicente Luca, probably pronouncing that wrong. A Robert Whitaker, a silver John Donson. Not familiar with who that is, but maybe he's a he's a good fighter. And then we have Dan Hooker. Interesting. All right, pack one down. I'm hoping for at least a Conor McGregor something in these two blasters. I don't really care if it's an insert, if it's uh, just a base card. Really anything Conor McGregor is exciting, so that's what I'm looking forward to. Let's see if we can pull it. Got a James Krause. Ooh, a green. Israel Adesanya. I am a huge fan of Israel Adesanya, so I am excited about that one. We have Kron Gra Grassi and a Kevin Holland rookie card. All right, put those to the side. This is a super sick card. Nice little green parallel. Um, these ones are not numbered, but uh, very cool. We'll put these base to the side as well. Oh boy, don't want to mess up the cards at all. All right. Let us know in the comments if you were able to pick up any UFC. The Walmart that I was at today only had five that were put out. Um, so I was able to pick up two, so that was exciting. But we got a Tanner Boser uh, rookie card, so that's pretty cool. Uh, Nikita Krylov, a lot of foreign uh, names that I'm not too familiar with. Uh, Max Holiday Instant Impact, and a Dustin Poirier. That's a pretty cool, oh my gosh, I'm fumbling these cards. Gotta make sure they are well protected. But uh, that is a very cool card. Excited about that one. Let's keep rolling through these. A Kamzat Chimeyev. <laughs> very cool. Fireworks Nate Diaz. That's a pretty cool card. I know Nate Diaz is a very popular fighter. And a Marvin Vittori rookie card. Very cool. All right, two packs left in this blaster. I've yet to get really a big hit. These packs are a little tough to open, but uh, we got it. Looks like I might have a green here. 
So that's cool. Kai Kara France. TJ Dillshaw. Mike Perry Green. Okay. And a John Jones. That's exciting. All right, I like that John Jones. I don't know if this... Yeah, these greens are not numbered. Um, I'll have to look at the box after this one and see which cards are numbered. Um, so I know you can get some pretty sick numbered cards out of these, but uh, Darren Till base card. Knockout artist Nate Diaz, that's a cool insert. Ian Heinich and a Jermaine de Randami. Not too familiar with the female fighters, but uh, that was Blaster 1. Uh, not too many big cards. I'll kind of do a full recap at the end. But let's go ahead and get into Blaster 2. That was a nice little Blaster 1. Uh, got a nice little introduction to UFC Prism. Uh, have been wanting to rip this for the longest time. I will probably end up purchasing more of this on the secondary market just because I want some to keep in a sealed collection because uh, for those of you guys that know I have a pretty big sealed collection that I'm uh, working to grow and keep for as long as possible. So I would love to add some of this to the collection but uh, today had to rip some UFC. Could not go another minute longer without it. So let's see. Blaster number two, pack one. Let's see what we got. Drew Dauber, I see a silver in this pack. Peter Yan. Frankie Edgar, silver. That is, a, that is such a beautiful card. But uh, I don't think that's going to be the fighter that we are looking for. Um, but that's all right. We move on. Alexander... Got a Robert Whitaker Green Instant Impact, Song Kanan, and a Neil Magny. All right, not too bad. Let's keep rolling through this blaster. Some of these packs open real easily, some of them do not. We got Zabit. Oh my gosh, I'm not even gonna try to pronounce that name. Augusto Sakai, Francis. I don't know how to pronounce that one either. Jimmy Flick. All right, so. Not the ones we are looking for still. Caitlin Chukagain. I, I, I don't even know. <laughs> fearless uh, instant uh, fearless insert. We have a Valentina base and a Diego Sanchez. I'm pretty sure Diego Sanchez is a, is a well known fighter, so I'll toss that in the sleeved pile. But. Uh, yeah, as I said, I'm, I'm, I'm a big fan of the UFC, but I really only follow the big names. Uh, so all these kind of uh, first years and kind of slept on fighters I'm not too familiar with. But we got a Randy Costa, and that's a rookie card, so that's exciting. Oh, and we got a green rookie card. So one of the main reasons that I wanted to rip UFC Prism is because I just wanted to kind of improve my knowledge on the sport and get to know some of these fighters. Uh, a little bit better and have somebody to root for uh, when I watch these cards and don't really know who I'm uh, who I'm watching so that was blaster 2 got a lot of base cards oh this is a rookie card I'll sleeve that one up but uh, let me do a quick sleeving and we'll showcase all the cards that we got all right so I got the stack of hits that I'll kind of just briefly go through we got this Mike Perry green we got this Marvin rookie card, this Instant Impact, Max Holloway, um, Tanner Boser rookie card, Kevin Holland. Uh, this is uh, Dustin Poirier, so that's exciting. John Jones base card, that's exciting. Israel Adesanya, I really like this one. Uh, knockout artist, that's a super sick insert, and it's green, so that's cool. Uh, we got this Frankie Edgar, this is a silver, not too familiar with him, but uh, it's a silver card, so that's cool. Randy Costa, this uh, Jerry, maybe I'm pronouncing that right, rookie card green, so that's probably a, one of the biggest hits that we have. And then we have this Yan uh, rookie card as well. So uh, let me know in the comments if I did well, uh, or if you have any uh, kind of tips and uh, information that you want to 
let me know because I am always open to learning more about UFC and kind of the cards that I've picked up here today. So hopefully you guys did enjoy this break. Uh, my name is John, has been John, this is Hype Hunters, and we'll see you guys next time. Mm -hmm.